Hello and welcome back to the Residual Royalty Academy. This is the channel where I show you how to go from nothing, that's zero, to at least $1,000 per month in profit in passive income by creating and selling low content books on Amazon KDP. So make sure you're subscribed and let's get into this video. So in this one, I'm gonna be talking about how to create and upload your book covers faster. So this is just something that I've been doing more recently uh, and it does make the process of uploading and creating your covers a lot faster uh, so hopefully you can learn something from this. So what we're gonna actually do is we're gonna make a little password log. So this is a really great niche. I mean, there's a lot of competition in here, but the ranks on here are pretty unbelievable uh, once you get past the most recent ones made. And if you actually go to the, the real first page, there's books ranked like down at like a thousand BSR, which is just pretty incredible. So you can see some of these books have been here for over a year and they're doing really, really well. So we're not really focusing on the cover design right now. We're gonna focus on uh, just kind of getting the books uploaded faster. So hopefully that's gonna help you a lot. So what we're gonna do first is we're just gonna make a template on here. I'd really recommend Tangent Templates if you don't have it already. So we're gonna make 110 page. Now let's just make 100 pages. Uh, we're gonna do white, interior bleed, we'll go yes. And then we're just going to hit download. So that's the cover template. And then we're just gonna take this number here, which is 14.48 and 10.25 and we're going to resize this so we've got that uh, so we've got 14.48 and 10.25 i believe that said so let's see yeah that's correct so we're just going to do that resize we don't need to copy it so this is the size of our book cover so now we can delete this wonderful logo here and we can delete this and we're just going to do a really quick design so password log this is just for example purposes. Maybe make this a bit wider. That didn't work, did it? Wrong one, I think I selected. Uh, letter, here we go. Make that bottom one a bit wider and make this bigger, just for the sake of uh, making a quick cover. So we need to add this template in to see where everything is lined up. Just gonna drag that to the top, there we go. And then we can easily see when this goes into the middle. So here we go, maybe we could go on to elements. So that's a pro element. I don't really like to select those, even though I'm on Canva Pro, I prefer to use the free elements. Uh, the license is a little complicated, so we could just select something like this now. Uh, we could just select something really simple like that for now. And then we're gonna put that there. So something like that, give or take, might be your first cover. And then you might have your author name or your pen name, as it's sometimes called, up in this corner here. And then what you want to do after that, what I would have done in the past is um, I would have gone on file and then I would have done make a copy and I would have made you know a similar design, maybe change the color, maybe change the words, maybe change the image, maybe change everything at the same time. And then I would have been able to save and download that later on after I've checked everything was fine. But what I would do instead is I would just use this button here and then maybe you want to change. So you can see now we're actually on the second one. So maybe we're going to change the background color. So maybe we're going to change it to, uh, maybe we're going to change it to gray. And then maybe we're going to change the image. So let's just use this one. Maybe you're going to change the author name. Maybe you're going to change the title. So passwords, I keep forgetting something funny maybe like that and then maybe that's your second cover so then you're just going to keep doing this and you're going to go through and through maybe you can look on here for some more ideas so what the f is my password all these different books here giving you some inspiration obviously don't copy them or you'll get done for copyright infringement um, but yeah so let's say this is your uh, so let's just do this what the f are my passwords and then maybe we're just going to make this one uh, in this color just for the sake of the video uh, okay and then we're going to do this just putting something completely random together and then maybe this is gray and at the back so something like that right this is just an example so then what you're going to do is once you've got those three and you've checked that everything's perfect you're just going to hit download and you're going to download all of them at once Instead of doing this separately, this just makes it a lot faster for you. And then it's going to put it into a into a sort of folder or a zip file. So there you go. So you've got a folder of PDFs now. And all you need to do now is come on to ilovepdf.com. Completely free service. Really, really recommend this. 
don't need to enter any email addresses, anything like that. And then you're just going to do that. You go on extract pages. Uh, you don't want to do this one. You want to do this one. And then you want to do this. And it says every page will be converted into a separate PDF file. Three PDFs will be created. Download this. And you can see now that you've got three separate PDFs, all with different designs, all with different titles, not spammy at all. And it's much, much quicker than going on make a copy or just creating something fresh uh, from scratch every time or, you know, making the dimensions every time. So hopefully this really helps you. And obviously these can just be uploaded straight into KDP. So hopefully that's helpful. Hopefully you've learned something that you didn't know already. If you have, make sure to smash the like button and I'll be sure to see you in the next video next time you tune in to the Residual Royalty Academy. They wanna count me out before I'm even